Welcome to tape two of Let Go with Alan Partridge. A sequence of easy exercises to relieve stress enhanced by the tropical music of the pan pipes. First, find a quiet place to recline, a bed or a big chair. I want you to imagine you're lying on the beach, divested of all the trappings of the 20th century. No mobile phone, batteries out of your pager, no clothes <laughs> completely naked, or with undergarments perhaps made from bark. You're all alone, the waves gently licking at your feet, your bark trunk soaking up the water like a sponge. <laughs> Your head loosens from the torso and bobs into the distance. Remember the breathing techniques from tape one. Please relax. I can't emphasize that enough. All of us experience stress, whether you're a heart surgeon making vital incisions, or just Dave Bloggs queuing for a rail ticket behind a man who's buying a travel pass, which involves photographs, scissors, forms being filled in, and his access won't wipe. You, you get the picture. But stress like this just won't go away, and it has to be combated. Sod off. <laughs> Idea for a programme entitled Yachting Mishaps. Uh, some funny, some tragic. <laughs> Presented by that man who was trapped upside down in his hull eating chocolate. for a program called Free Spirits. No, I need to change that to um, Bad Attitude. <laughs> hello? Oh, hello. Um, I'd like to speak to Fernando Partridge, please. <laughs> it's his father. It's his father. <laughs> ah. Hello. Who's she? Is she your, your latest, uh... Ah, oh, right. Um, both sound exhausted. Have you been running? <laughs> um, I was just wondering if you uh, wanted to go for a drink. Yeah. Fernando, you're 22 years old and you're spending your Saturday afternoon in bed with a girl. You're wasting your life. <laughs> it's a beautiful day. Take her out to a, a local fort or a Victorian folly. <laughs> yeah, of course. Look, look, your mum and I, believe me, your, your mum we did it everywhere. We, you know, in the lounge, in the hall, behind a large boulder on Hell Valin for my birthday. <laughs> Actually, that is where you were conceived. <laughs> but we just, we just didn't take precautions. No, no, we were delighted. I mean, at first I was mortified, you know, but, uh, <laughs> then you were born and we uh, grew to like you. <laughs> Remember I, uh, I left a tartan flask up there, yeah, one of those uh, very fragile ones with a screw-on cup stroke cap. So, these days they're much more resilient. Uh, sort of, they took the technology from NASA, basically, which is extraordinary. So modern, modern flasks today are directly linked with the Apollo 11 space mission. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> oh, sod him. <sighs> Hello, is that Curry's? I'd like to make an inquiry about uh, two supplementary auxiliary speakers uh, to go with my uh, MIDI hi fi system, apropos achieving surround sound. <laughs> apropos. <laughs> it's Latin, isn't it? Well, you ought to have a basic grasp of Latin if you're, uh, if you're working in curries. <laughs> oh, you've got them. Excellent. Good. Um, one, one last thing. What time do you knock off? Huh. Fancy going for a drink? <laughs> oh, OK, just thought I'd ask. Okay. 